Hey guys, it's me Rahul and today I'm going to show you how to install Windows subsystem for Linux WSL on Windows 11. It is like installing Linux inside of Windows and it is actually pretty cool. So let's install it. So first thing you want to do is open up terminal. So click on start, search for terminal and you want it to open us as an administrator with administrator rights. So right click on the terminal search uh, terminal app. Then click on run as administrator which will open up the terminal here and in here what you can do is so there are a couple of options there are a couple of linux distribution which you can get so to see all the available distribution just type wsl hyphen hyphen list hyphen hyphen online then press enter which will give you the list of available distribution that you can have and the default is set to Ubuntu. So what you can do is if you want to install anything specific like Debian, Kali Linux or something like that, you can type WSL hyphen hyphen install then hyphen D and you can type Debian or whatever is here, right? So I'm going to go with Debian as of now. So just press enter and if you if you just want to install ubuntu what you can type is you can just type wsl hyphen hyphen install and that's it and it will install ubuntu by default so i'm going to press enter and it will say installing virtual machine platform and it is going to go ahead and download and install the my windows subsystem for linux and it will actually take a couple of minutes and once it is successfully installed, it's going to say changes will not be effective until the system is rebooted. So just restart your system. Go to start, restart. And once the system restarts, it will automatically open up this command prompt and ask you to ask you to basically enter the Unix username. So I'm going to give Rahul G. Just G. Enter. I'm going to type a password as well enter then i'm going to type that password one more time and it successfully installed and it logged me in as well so i'm going to type a couple of linux command right so it absolutely works so this is now installed in windows is basically linux subsystem uh, basically you can say that it's a linux sandbox kind of thing so that's that's pretty much it that it, it is as simple as that that is how you install a wsl in Windows 11. Thank you.